So, Sarah, how are you feeling after being fired? Um, I was initially shocked that I was fired, but I'm actually relieved in a way. Why are you relieved? I just feel like I'm free. I don't have to go back in the house. So I am relieved in a way. Mm. Do you think it was fair? Um, uh, I don't think I should have been fired, but I think... Um, looking back at it, um, I didn't defend myself properly in the boardroom mm -hmm. and maybe that was a big reason for my firing. But looking at the task, I think there were major mistakes that were made, mm -hmm. namely product selection. We had tacky wedding dresses, which Helene chose, and they were really difficult to sell. So do you think Helen should have gone then? I think in the real business world, that's how it worked. You know, the person who made the most failures would be the person to go. So in that sense, yeah, that would have been a fair decision. So Alan did criticise your sales technique, though, yes. didn't he? Yes, yeah. Do you think that's a bit worrying, considering you're a car trader? No, because I'm not. I don't sell cars. That's not what I do for a living. I think this car salesperson has been blown out of pro pro proportion. That's not what I am. I'm a trainee barrister. Mm -hmm. And I think he kept thinking I was a used car salesperson. And he tried to kind of think, oh, gosh, she's selling cakes. And she's a used car salesperson. That's what they do. Mm -hmm. And that's why he didn't pick on Michael as much. You said in the cab afterwards that you prefer working on your own. Don't you think it's quite important, though, being able to work within a team going into business? Um, I didn't say I'd work on my own. What I did say when I got into the taxi was um, I do want to work as myself, but I do realise that working in this team is important, but I don't want to work. I said I don't like working in a team like the team that I had because mm. that was really difficult for me. Do you think you'll stay in contact with anyone from the show? Um, if any of the candidates wish to contact me, I'd be more than happy to answer their calls. So why did you go on the show in the first place? I went on the show because I wanted to work for Sir Alan. That's why I went. But I was never desperate for the job. But I would have been really, really happy if I got the position. I really would have. But um, I've come out of there knowing that I did try my best. Mm -hmm. And that's the most important thing. When you come out of there thinking you didn't try your best, you kick yourself. But coming out of there knowing that I did try my best, but it wasn't meant to be. Mm. What well, is it about the job that you would have wanted, though? Would, would it have been the... The money, or was it working with Sarah? Allen? No, it's not just the money. You're working for someone who's respectable and who's got really far, and you know you can learn from that person. I always like to associate myself with people who I know I can learn a lot from. Mm. Who do you tip to win? Um, Rafe would be fantastic. I don't know if he'll get to the finals, but um, you know, in business, common sense, integrity and honesty are really, really important. Mm. And he, at least he has those attributes and work ethic. Mm. Did you think that you were going to win when you went on? Of course. I would have never have applied if I didn't think I was going to win. At the beginning, you saw me as really feisty, you know, going for it. I really thought I had a chance because I saw other candidates didn't have common sense and I didn't get involved in the bitching. I didn't get involved in any of that. So I really thought I had a good chance of winning.